density. Objectives. Define density. Determine the density of a regular object. Determine the density of an irregular object. Use the density to calculate the mass or volume of a substance. And finally, explain why different forms of the same element can have different densities. Density. Density is a physical property of matter that compares the mass of a substance to its volume. Every substance has a unique density that distinguishes it from other substances. It can be used to identify a specific substance. For example, in the chemistry reference table S, there are selected properties of elements, including densities. For example, the density of sodium is 0.97 gram per centimeter cube, while the density for magnesium is 1.74 gram per centimeter cube. The, this data can be used to distinguish one element from the other. What is the relationship between mass and volume? Density is equal to mass divided by volume. Here we have a data table with mass and volume for one type of substance. Inputting the mass as 27.0 gram divided by 10 centimeter cube, we have the density as 2.7 gram per centimeter cube. Calculating the density for the all data, the all equal to 2.7. The density for a substance remains constant. If you were to plot the mass versus volume, we would have a direct relationship. As the mass increases, the volume increases for a substance. How can we determine the density of a regular solid? First, we need to measure its mass. Here it is given as 600 grams. Next, we must determine its volume, which is length times width times height. Here, it is found to be 250 centimeter cube. Using these two data, we can calculate the density, which is the mass divided by the volume, 600 grams divided by 250 centimeter cube. The density of the solid is 2.4 grams per centimeter cube. How can you determine the mass given the volume and density? Determine the mass of 118.05 centimeter cube of iron. Here we are given the volume as 118.05 centimeters cube. The density is not given, therefore we can look this up in reference table S. It is 7.87 gram per centimeters cube. Using our formula, density is equal to mass over volume, substituting our values, here we have 7.87 gram per centimeter cube is equal to mass divided by 16.05 centimeter cube. Rearranging the formula, we have 126 grams. How can you determine the volume given mass and density? Determine the volume of 321.5 grams of zinc. Here we are given the grams of zinc as 321.5 and looking up reference table S, we can find the density of zinc as 7.134 gram per centimeter cube. Substituting in our density formula, we have 7.134 gram per centimeter cube is equal to 321.5 gram divided by volume. Rearranging your formula, we have 45.07 centimeter cube. How can we determine the density of an irregular object? Determine the density of a rock. First, we need to measure the mass of the rock. Here it is found to be 64.00 grams. Next, we must measure its volume. We can use water displacement, where when we drop the rock into a measuring cylinder of water, the difference in the water level will give us its volume. The initial volume is 20.0 ml. The final volume is 30.0 ml. The difference is 10.0 ml. Using our density formula, mass divided by volume, substituting, we have 6.40 grams per milliliter. How does changing the amount of a substance impacts its density? Let's calculate the density of both objects. The first one weighs 600 grams. Its volume is calculated to be 250 centimeter cube. Calculating its density, we have 2.4 grams per centimeter cube. The second object, its volume is 125 centimeters cube and its density is also 2.4 grams per centimeter cube. The density of a substance 
does not change from one sample to another. It remains the same. How can atoms of the same element have different densities? In the solid phase, arsenic occurs in two forms. One form, yellow arsenic, has a density of 1.97 grams per centimeter cube. The other form, gray arsenic, has a density of 5.78 grams per centimeter cube. Compare in terms of the arrangement of atoms why the two forms of arsenic has different densities at STP. In gray arsenic, the atoms are arranged closer together, resulting in more mass in a unit volume. Therefore, it has a higher density. Or, we could say the atoms in yellow arsenic are further apart. Therefore, there is less mass per unit volume than in gray arsenic. 